so a, a, a clean sheet and a, and a point. Uh, is, do you think that was a fair reflection of the game? Um, yeah, potentially. I think we certainly tried to um, start in the ascendancy again, created a, you know some really good chances. Odie's had a couple of shots, went within a whisker of going through 1v1, just couldn't quite get that first touch away. Um, so we were certainly, I felt we, we, we were trying to be exciting, we are trying to play on the front foot, we are trying to attack. Um, but obviously we had, a, we, had a, we had a bad day Saturday, you know, we got, you know, I left a bit on the players on Saturday. I think the crowd left a bit on us all as well, rightly so, after that performance Saturday. So we had to show real character, we had to come out and show that. And I think we certainly showed showed that today, you know, with a clean sheet, we had mm. to defend. Like, you know, Eastley a strong, a strong National League side. And um, I think both teams defended their boxes really well. Um, and I think that was the tale of the, of the night, is uh, some good defensive displays, you know, Big centre half winning a lot of headers, um, so it was it was quite end to end. I don't think it was a you know real boring nil nil. You could see two teams go, going at it, and uh, you know we went within, within a whisker quite a few times. But the important thing was was that we we showed that grit and that determination, that togetherness, and um, you know we had a reaction from Saturday. I think we certainly got that, and um, you know the positive is is the clean sheet. We've been searching for that, and we've got that, and uh, you know hopefully that'll give us some confidence and a platform to grow. Exactly like you said, easily of scored in every game this season haven't they they've played so nullifying them is, is a real something to really build on um it's, it's clean of this clean sheet of the season for us so does that give the defense a bit a bit of a confidence boost now yeah i would hope so you know and we've gone like i said this league punishes you and we've you know some, we've been masters of our own downfall with some loose moments but i think we've been defending our box well we've you know we do a lot of hard work on on it you know on the training ground and it's nice to see that come to fruition tonight but We've got to see it again Saturday now. Like um, you know, it's a you know a tough tough away trip to Scunthorpe now, but a game we can again go there, you know, defend well, but also attack well as well. We saw Odie well, kind of forcibly go off after quite a good performance. With, I think cramping up, wasn't he? Mm -hmm. But um, you you didn't make an, an you you didn't make the your other two subs. What, what was the thinking behind that? I think the other the other group were in the in the in the flow of the game. Um, I felt we were always countering dangerously. I felt there's their moments always in there. Um, I, you know, I, di I didn't think anyone deserved to come off. Could I have freshened it up was always the question. But I've also got a question that Eastleigh, a big team, and we were defending our box well, and there's some people with key roles in set plays. And, um, you know, you've got to be dependable in other areas of the game, i.e., you know, set plays, defensive positions. So as much as we wanted to attack the game, we knew that we, you know, we needed to keep that clean sheet. But we, we were attacking it anyway. So I, I, didn't, I didn't feel that we weren't getting out. I didn't feel that we were under the, the cosh. I felt that that opening was happening. I thought Faisal was finding good pockets. I thought Frank broke really well, um, and I thought Ryan. And we made the change of Justin. So um, you know, you know, I had two wide men and a forward to bring on a freshen. I brought one on. Um, I think the other two positions that he could have come on. I think the other players have real key positions in, in set plays. And Odie having a good performance and, and Faisal as well, you know, a, a man of the match performance chosen by the sponsors. Mm. Uh, it gives us a, a few more options, doesn't it? A, a bit of um, squad depth and with Whelan coming back and playing well again. Obviously, there's, there's a few options ahead of Scunthorpe this weekend. Yeah, definitely. And I think Tom Whelan had a combative performance and just showed a, you know, like an, older, an older head in there. And I think you can see that Faisal and Odie have had a good sort of two, three weeks with us now. So they're, they're right on script on on how we want to play and I think they really, you know, Odie really added his pace and is an exciting uh, player and I think Faisal obviously technically is, is, is has got real quality so, uh, you know, I think he, he, he um, his out of possession game was, was strong as well and, uh, you know, he was certainly an exciting watch tonight. Click here for the latest match highlights and click here to subscribe. Are you in with a shot? Look below for more information.